So today is probably going to be one of the craziest, if not the craziest days out here in Antarctica. So we are in Fawn Harbor and later we'll be heading to Porter Point. And well, it is another cold day, obviously over here in Antarctica. However, believe it or not, we're going to be jumping in this water today. I am going to go ahead and get Laura. We're gonna get some breakfast first. They already have the Zodiac out, as you can see. We're taking a Zodiac trip and if things go right, we'll be stepping on land later as well as doing some paddling with what they call the duckies. That's how exciting is this? We just got our first whale of the day. It is right next to our ship and over by the Zodiacs. Lauren, what do you think? I'm almost crying because I saw the tail. <laughs> that was the first time seeing the tail? It's so beautiful out here. It's the first time for me to see a whale like that, so. <laughs> Show you guys the breakfast for the morning. See what we got on tap here. Usual eggs, bacon, mushrooms, cheese, all that good stuff. Lauren, are you ready for today? Um, yeah? You're not afraid? Oh, nothing. <laughs> oh, I have bad news. We just received our first cancellation of the day for the kayaks and the ducking. You see those little inflatable kayak things out in the distance? Yeah, those are the uh, duckings. However, unfortunately, due to the unpredictable weather, it was just snowing here a second ago. A little bit more calmer now. Waters were getting rough, but it's very, very random, unpredictable weather. And for that reason, they decided to take these guys, the kayaks here, and it looks like they're gonna bring the crane down to bring them back up and they're probably gonna be done for the day. Yay! So, I am ready to call group F and anyone who had their paddling discontinued. Well, I just proved my point. Things are extremely unpredictable and things can change literally at the drop of a hat. So they're telling us not to get undressed, just to be prepared because the weather is clearing up for now. So we may actually be able to go on the kayaks. So it looks like they're putting up the kayaks. However, we have got the announcement. They're at least going to have us go out on the other Zodiacs today. So I'll put these guys up, but we're going for a Zodiac cruise. It's time to go outside. We have to go check in first at the Atlas Lounge and then go put on our gear. Let's go to the mud room. Time to make the preparations. You guys know the deal. We're geared up and officially ready for day three. Yeah. We go, time to board. Lewis, this is the man with the plan. We're finishing our load up process. After that, we are good to go. over there may have been used for whaling. Look at all this ice. Oh man, it's some cold water. I had to cut back when we were on the ship or on the boat rather because uh, my mic ended up cutting out but now as you can see I'm freezing cold but I do have to get ready for well another event so I won't reveal the surprise just yet just know that things are about to get very very cold for me and wet what are you looking for it's our group let's do it so our group just got called lauren and i are going to be doing the infamous polar plunge you never heard of that basically we're going to be taking our swim trucks and a little bit of courage and jumping into the frigid frozen waters of antarctica now lauren i have to ask before we do this are you afraid i'm not afraid i'm not afraid i'm never afraid to be honest <laughs> yeah okay we are going to be the last to go today right here in the back of the line Dancing Queen Ah, 
So we have officially survived the polar plunge and I need a drink. They actually got shots of tequila waiting for us, which is very much needed. If you ever get the chance, definitely knock it off the bucket list. Try the polar plunge. Once again, I had an unforgettable time. However, I am freezing. I'm going to go ahead and jump in this sauna here for a second because in about 20 minutes, we are going back out again to step foot in Antarctica, but I do want to keep this one organic, enjoy my time with Lauren, and well, not have all the cameras and equipment and all that jazz. So I do want to end this video here, but just know as usual, I love and appreciate every single one of you. I highly recommend you try the Polar Plunge. It's definitely not for the weak. Hit that like button on your way out. Subscribe if you haven't already, and let me know your thoughts on this in the comment section below. I appreciate all of you. I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.